What is going on guys and girls of course, welcome back to CK2 Elder Kings and King Ram of Winterhold. And in between episodes, I have been looking for possible marriages because we've got quite a few more family uh, characters right now, family members. And, uh, you know, some of them, especially our sisters, want ha have been wanting to get married for a while. Now, I found one uh, that I want to marry to my uh, older sister, uh, well, to my younger sister, but the older one of the two, um, she has not had a child yet, so, you know, she's the, she's the one that, that we can trust a bit more, and she is going to be married off to Prince Balgroove of the Rift, um, let's arrange a marriage with them here, uh, what? Honestly, I just checked, and it worked, so that's kind of, that's so strange, that is so strange. Wait, hold on. Okay, so let me check this again. Um, arrange a marriage. Wasn't that just possible? Damn, I'm so certain it was. Um, maybe it wasn't. That's so annoying. That's so freaking annoying. This that this you know doesn't really work, but. Alright, well, whatever. Then we're gonna... I don't know. Maybe once she's no longer sick, maybe this works. But, basically, that would create an alliance, or at least a non-aggression pact between us and the Rift. And I feel like that's a really, really good idea. Uh, but the other one is actually our daughter, Siri, And I want her to be betrothed to the one with dragon blood. So we know the dragonborn here. He has two sons. And this one right here has a dragon blood. I just kind of want to have them you know, betrothed. So, uh, let's have Siri. They're also of similar age. Matrilineal would not be possible, but that's fine. We'll have them married, and I think this would be just kind of cool. Just just to say that we're married to someone with dragon blood. I think that's really, really good. It would boost our prestige. Uh, although, maybe it, it won't. I, I, I don't know, but it, it just, to me, it feels like something we want to do. Um, and now my sister here, I, I would like to keep her at court because she's currently our steward. So, you know, I would like to Oh, wow, this guy's incapable. Oh, he's got fever. I, I, I kind of hope he dies, honestly, but whatever. Uh, that's pretty That's pretty mean to say, but yeah. Um, so yeah, we've got some of them married off, and I hope this alliance still somehow works. Can I invite you to court? No. That's fine. Also, our plot doesn't seem to be going anywhere. That's pretty frustrating, but oh well. Oh well. Really hate that. Whatever. Whatever, we're still on our way to um, sack Whiterun. This has been accepted, very good. And we've got fever again. Damn it, so many diseases, what the hell? It's pretty annoying. At least our wife is doing fine for now. She wants to obtain an artifact. Uh, okay. She's patient now, as well. Didn't I tell her to join a guild? Hmm... I don't think I did. Join the Mercantile Guild, actually. Go ahead and do that. And... Hmm. Yeah, maybe I can get an artifact for her. But not right now. Not right now. Okay. Yeah, we've got slow fever now. Sure, apparently she's taking good care of us. Very nice. Abdominal pain. And uh, Turiel died. Was that our friend? No. I don't know who he is. I don't think we care. Because that's definitely not our friend. Our friend is still alive. Oh, we got diarrhea. That's always nasty. Thank you. Um, Let's seek treatment for our illness. Very well. Okay, so we don't actually have enough men. That's pretty annoying. Can I raise some more? 53, Sarthal. Ah, uh, that's maybe a bit too much. We'll raise these men then. I hope this is going to be enough. But actually, this is committing too much for just a raid. Is there something else that can be sacked? Yeah, alright, let's do that then. Honestly, this is like the whole point of this is just for my mother to can... So she can uh, show some bravery, right? And for the Kata as well. Um, so, just want them to, to do something, so really... That's it. Okay, seek treatment for illness, please. And let's see what we can do here very well. Okay, 
she recommended to minimize the effects of diarrhea, we should eat plenty of fruit and freshly baked bread. And we shall. We've got the typhoid fever here. Cure disease, please. And she's done a great job. Very good. Very good indeed. All right. Well, yeah, obviously. I mean, she's doing such an amazing job. She's also tr treated our sister. Man, she is truly amazing. I wonder if we can give her another honorary title. A food taster. Oh, no, she doesn't like that at all. Okay. Maybe we'll make her a court tutor. Because she's apparently pretty skilled. Let's do that as well. We'll give her all the good traits, man. Okay, we can... Yeah, brew some potions again for 10 gold. That's not bad at all. And uh, we have no more fever. Perfect. Okay, so they're actually going to attack us here very soon. So we'll just sack it and then we'll move out. There you go. Sacked it. And we actually... Oh, look at this. We've got some uh, prisoners. And we gained 20 gold. So that's all I really wanted. And we'll leave now. And uh, who's this guy anyway? Oh, look at this. How's Ingvar? Ingvar. The heir to Whiterun. Wait, what? The heir to the kingdom of Whiterun is in our dungeons? That is insane, dude. That's in Wow, and his daughter as well? How do we manage to capture them? That's pretty insane. But this feels so good. This feels so good because they still owe us tons of money. So, uh... That's just feel... I'm just feeling good about that, honestly. Also, my plot... Uh, why is it... Why It's just... Man, the chances are just decreasing. That's so terrible. Oh, we've actually been caught. Damn it. Alright, so we're not going to win this. Um, but we managed to... I don't know, retreat still. Let's just stand down our troops. I don't mean to fight him. And we'll have you just go back to training some troops here. But that was pretty impressive. We have the heir to the kingdom of Whiteron in our dungeons right now. Oh, and we're a cruel man. Doesn't he want to ransom the prisoner? He can't afford it. Well, maybe this is a way for us to get our money back. Oh my god, I feel really good about this. I feel really good about this. Yep. That's what, I mean, that's what happens. I would have loved to burn down Whiterun, uh, but that's fine. We might do that at some point. A group of hedge knights has come to visit Winterhold. Queen Julia, Terra has met with them and asked for my reply. Um, have a lavish feast. Um, sure. Why not? We have got something to celebrate, so I think so. Sure. Now, I do wonder if there's something special we can do with this guy. Um... You know what? I'm still very much pissed off about losing this this much money. And so I think we're going to do something bad to him. I think torturing him. We're still cruel. We could blind him. Let's do something that is less permanent. Let's just torture him for now. But I might cast castrate and blind him. Okay, let's, let's actually say this right now. If this dude... Actually, he's pretty close to it, having enough money. Let me see. He's not the one that's going to ransom the money. It's the queen. His queen. Um, she does not have enough money. Um, Alright, so I'm going to give her, I don't know, a year? And then he's going to be castrated or something. Because we want the money back. Right? So let's torture him for now. And, uh, yeah. Think twice before crossing us again. And he's a bit stressed because of it. But that's important to me. We'll actually make an important character. Let's see who else we have. We also have the little girl. Uh, I think. That, uh... Yeah, that, that one's important as well. Can we ransom her, maybe? Nope, she's just as expensive. Now, she's eight years old. Mm, we'll put her on house arrest. We'll be... We'll be merciful to an eight-year-old. I mean, she's not done anything wrong. But this dude? He's 18, man. He's gonna suffer. He's gonna suffer. And then who else did we get? Some lowborn. Does she actually marry matter at all? She could be recruited, but I really don't care. Honestly, I'll just I'll just keep her. Like I don't mind. And then we've got these children as well. Um. They have no interest. That's so... That's so bad. 
Same with this one, probably. Uh, I mean, I just don't care enough for these children, to be honest. Who's this? Some lowborn? She's not important. But no one wants... Yeah, no one wants to uh, get them back. Hmm. See, spells become counselor. I mean, I could just execute her. And her suffering. But why would I care? You know what? Let's just leave her in prison. Honestly, I don't, I don't care. Uh, we'll uh, give them a farewell feast as well. And someone has arrived at our court. Why do I care? Oh, wow. That's a pretty... That's... That dude has some claims. Interesting. Uh, okay. That's an interesting person to join. That's a pretty decent general. And he has got some treasury as well. You know what? I'm going to actually make you join the Fighters Guild for now. And I'll probably make you a commander as well. Damn. 21 Marshal? That's that's pretty decent. That's pretty decent. Um, And yeah, we've got plenty of terrible commanders. Especially you don't need to be a commander. There you go. That's much better. Alright, moving on. I think we might want to start developing ruins in Sarthal. Here. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's do that for now. I want to see what that does. Okay, a new bird has arrived in, in the muse and a new book of the art of writing poetry is in the library. Uh, I think we're more focused on learning. Uh, take the book. Let's see what we find. Damn! This book about poetry is really boring. It is filled with do's and do nots and I just want to throw it out of the window. Uh, okay, so we, can ha we have the choice to either just be depressed or not. So honestly, I'm just not going to be... I'm just going to choose not to be depressed. So there you go. Thank you. Because, um, yeah, it's just... I don't want to I don't want to have terrible... Terrible events. Oh, and there is our mother. Finally, she died of typhoid fever. But not, you know, not before taking some very valuable prisoners together with our Huskull. You know, that's that was so good. Such a good raid. So thank you, Mom. You, you did a good job. But now we need a new marshal. And, um, I believe that, um, Dukata has shown her value. She's actually experienced now. Look at this. Has tested their mettle in battle, battle, and secured victory through their leadership and skill. So, I think that's enough, uh, of, yeah, that's enough. That's all we needed to know. Um, and now we, we can appoint her. She's earned her place on our council, together with our wife and our sister. So yeah, and this random woman whose son is uh, is going to um, to get his titles back. I promise. Okay, with our strong devotion to the Eight Divines Faith, you have spent countless hours reading the Covenant, thinking about the meaning and origin of the sacred words therein. There are some things that don't quite correspond to what the S are saying in their sermons. Hmm, that's very strange. What are the S? I don't know. Uh, I have no right to question them. Perhaps it should not be taken so literally. Mm, these are charlatans. The These S are charlatans. What are these S? I don't know. Uh, we gain fervor. Religious studies will be removed. And we get a religious philosopher. I, I suppose that they just don't know. I mean, our learning is relatively high. So yeah, these are charlatans. Of course. The new bird is almost too perfect. I enjoy every hunt with her, and the cook has trouble finding new recipes for rabbit. Uh, sure. And we're going to become a falconer. And I think that even though we are a religious philosopher now, um, we might want to change to, to hunting. Because we've had a lot of fun with this, and I feel like it would kind of fit. I mean, we've been just doing more martial stuff. We were kind of forced to because of, you know, this one guy, for example. Um, you know, we've got a hunting dog, we've got a falcon, um, and so, yeah, I think, um, hunting might be something that we're gonna pick up. Well, you know, we're a lot older now, so, yeah. Especially since we, you know, we became a battle mage, I feel that fits. Also, we seem to have a weak claim on the Kingdom of the Rift. 
And if you don't want to marry, arrange a betrothal. Ah, uh, no, a marriage then. <laughs> uh, that's pretty depressing. Thanos, sick. He's gonna say no. That's pretty annoying. All right, so I'm gonna have to find someone else for my sisters because they're getting old. Um, the Prince of Havingar. I don't know, man. He's kind of sucky. Then again, these people are all t kind of terrible, to be honest. There is a interesting master mage, experienced fighter. But why would that matter? Who's this? A master crusader. Armed with supreme martial knowledge, skill at the healing arts and maintenance of their personal effects, their this crusader gallantly charges into fight of the fight, shrugging off even the worst wounds. Wow, that's pretty amazing. Combat steel plus eight. Damn. <sighs> I wish I could just let them pick their own husbands at this point, because there's there seems to be nobody great available. What about yeah, you're just a little girl. Here, we've got a nine-year-old. That's just pretty young. Maybe this dude can be married? Lord Mayor? I would also consider marrying my vassals. This guy is 12. Um, okay, you would agree to this. My sister, 26. Mm, actually, I'm going to marry you off to... Th uh, yeah. To my sister, actually. Let's do that. Why not? Let's create an alliance with our vassal. That's fine. He's one of our strongest vassals, so I think that's a that's an interesting idea. Um, and obviously, I'm gonna start having Lokia become my uh, my heir. But we have Tanistry, so it's really not that difficult to do. Also, why are you educating him? Pretty sure I wanted to do it myself, but all right, whatever. Good. Moving on. Um. Some prospective students of magic are visiting the guild hall and would like to learn... Oh, basics of defense. Very good. Can do war magic again. We do need a designated regent because our mother died. So I feel like we're going to pick our wife, the queen. There we go. And there's still so many titles I need to give out, man. Paramount Knight. That could be this dude. All right. Well, I guess he's the only one. He's the only option. So he's going to get that. And as food taster, I'm going to pick the dude of Bleak Rock. Sure. He's gonna... He, he, he can die. That's fine. And some more Huskarls can be picked. Now this dude of the Companion's Bloodline, always very sp prestigious, so I'm gonna have him as Huskarl as well. Good. Alright, moving on. And today's lesson will be on mysticism. And to this end, I will show how one can telekinetically deflect a solid object. I request the visitors to throw a few stones at me. I will use the power of my mind to negate their attacks. Let's begin. The volunteers, perhaps a bit too enth enthusiastically, throw some rocks my way. Focusing, I catch the stones midair with my mind and gingerly take them to the floor. The audience applauds. I orate on how I perform this feat and they happily listens. Uh, that's pretty cool to know what, you know, we've learned so far. I wonder if we can specialize again. Oh no, we're still, we're actually still training. Interesting. Maybe we want to compose a book. I feel like we've learned quite a lot, so let's do that. Uh, complexity of war, intricacies of relationships, and the honor of the divines. I feel like we've been really focusing on war lately, so let's, let's, you know, tackle this. A martial theme. That's pretty good. Although learning would be fine too. And, oh no, Laofu died. Well, that's sad um and he doesn't seem to be the only one but we still got you so you must be pretty upset i tortured close kin yeah that's that's the thing and we still have your ear imprisoned that's so good she's actually under house arrest arrange a marriage for her or betrothal actually let me see if we can force that no we can't that would be so good could blind her as well. So, but that's so good. So, East March is weak. Uh, the Rift is currently in a war. White Run, Huffinger was destroyed basically. White Run, 
can't do anything because we have their heir imprisoned. We're in a really good spot. Like we are very, like we're very much capable of claiming, um, uh, of claiming the kingship here. We're definitely the most powerful at this moment. But yeah, I, I guess uh, at this point I'm gonna have to end the episode. I hope you guys have enjoyed, and I will see you next time.